Of all the things that are important to you, where would you rank safety? Kids don't think about it when they're playing. But if you have a family, you want them to be safe. You want to be safe while you're at home or when you're at work. responsibility and people who depend on us. In order to be safe and return home at the end of the day, important safety rules must be followed. <coughs> Lift truck operators are just like millions of other professionals who earn their living by operating equipment or vehicles. It takes skill, training, and experience. Realizing that no job on the ground or in the air can be done at the expense of safety. Remember, you're working on a piece of machinery that weighs about 9,000 pounds. With a load, it increases up to 14,000 pounds. That's equivalent to six cars. Lift truck operators have a difficult job. They lift heavy loads and they maneuver in tight spaces. Safety isn't something anyone sets out to ignore, but tight schedules, heavy equipment, pedestrian traffic, and congested workspace can compromise safety any hour, any minute, any time. Unfortunately, accidents can happen, but accidents happen more and cost more than we realize. Between lost time, increased insurance premiums, and litigation, common for accidents to cost a company over a million dollars. Some companies cannot survive the aftermath and close their doors permanently. Then there is personal injury. Let's not forget the family, especially the children. One accident can cost a child a lifetime of happy memories. But we can improve safety with the right training and the right rules. Government studies have shown effective training programs improve lift truck operator safety performance by as much as 70%. OSHA, the Occupational Safety and Health Administration, estimates that there are 68,000 accidents every year in the U.S. involving lift trucks. Of those, over 100 people are killed. Here's how the accidents break down in terms of causes. 25.3% tip over. 18.8% personnel are struck by a powered industrial truck. 14.4% personnel are struck by a falling load. 12.2% employee falls off elevated forks. 7% the lift truck runs off a loading dock or other surface. And 6.1% lift truck is improperly maintained. With numbers like these and the cost of accidents, it's no wonder that OSHA requires that employers give proper training to all their lift truck operators. It also states that only trained and authorized personnel can operate a specific piece of equipment. 